Hello everyone, what is cooking all you good looking people out there and welcome to, well, a very special series of video that I've been doing which is all about update uh, Alpha 15 of Universe Sandbox 2 which we've been uh, checking out. Uh, saw the new UI yesterday, wow, very, very nice, I really like the new UI, it is beautiful, uh, I think it really makes this stand out as a definite uh, successor to Universe Sandbox, it doesn't feel very much uh, uh, similar, it doesn't feel nearly as similar to it as it used to, very, very cool, I like that upgrade, uh, now it is time to check out some other cool stuff, so what I wanted to check out in this episode is some of the uh, simulations that uh, that they have done. So uh, let's create some stuff from presets. And I know that uh, I know that some of the things, or maybe it wasn't, uh, maybe it wasn't that. But we'll we'll check out random solar system, Earth and moons, um, orbiting. Okay, galaxy, spiral, ring of galaxies, uh, orbiting charts. No, we don't necessarily. We don't. We don't want. Uh, to go check out any of those today. Yes, open an existing simulation. That is what I would like to do. Uh, good. So, uh, plan is what it, it wasn't in planets, exoplanets. So we've got these guys, which are really cool. Supernovas, stellar evolution of our sun. Oh man, supernova, the sun in solar system. I don't remember this one being there. All right, well, I guess uh, I'm going to go faster. Okay, well, that wasn't nearly as exciting as it could have been. Uh, is the sun? Sun Nova Remnant. Okay, well, that was something. Supernova type LA. All right, let's zoom out a little bit. Ooh, check that out. That's cool. Has anything happened? Sirius B. Okay. So it absorbs some stuff from it. It's hard to tell. Hmm. Well, there it goes. Okay. So what I wanted to check out was core. Was it in core? Ooh, binary pulsar. Yes, that is it. This is one of the cool things I wanted to show off. So pulsars. These are one of the new features in the game. That is right, pulsars. And these are binary pulsars. So that is really, really cool. So pulsars are um, something new that have been added in Alpha 15. And wow, just check that out. So we got Taylor and Hulse. I don't know uh, what those names are references to. But let's play around with this pulsar, uh, with these, with these pulsars, because that would be very cool. So... Obviously, one of our favorite things to do is to just increase the mass of the pulsars. So we just like, oh, oh god. Did it not like that? Just like flashing for whatever reason. Okay, I don't think it appreciated that. That's fine. Oh boy. Did the game crash? Hmm. I think that might have crashed the game. All right. I'll be back in a second. Or maybe I can... No, I don't think I can figure that out. All right, I'll be back in a second. All right. Well, that was... <laughs> there you go. That was interesting. I had to restart Steam after that one. Jeez. Uh, apparently, it did not uh, like that as much. But, of course, as you guys know, this is in alpha. Uh, so, you know, what can you do? White Dwarf with Pulsar. Oh, okay. So this is a pulsar right here. Jeez, it sure seems to be going a bit fast for us to appreciate that. So white dwarf with pulsar. So where's the white dwarf? That's the white dwarf. And this is the pulsar. Oh, well, that's cool. All right, so we got a new, we got something new right over here. And there's, there's another white dwarf. Well, okay, what, what kind of fun things can happen? All right, let's go edit this white dwarf right here. What kind of forgetting okay just click once that's fine so what kind of fun things can happen if we uh, mess with this you know we can mess with this make this a little bit more massive see how this affects uh, our other system over here there you go so obviously uh, uh, you know changing the mass that's one of my favorite things to do should we go try and do the other one I, I don't know maybe we should save that to the end 
I think I think we'll save that to the end. The uh, trying to mess with the mass of the the two pulsars orbiting each other. We'll save that for the end of the video, just in case it crashes out again. In which case, I can just end the video on that. And there you go. Everyone will be happy. Auto orbit, zero velocity. That's always interesting. All right. Actually, yeah. Let's 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 do that. Let's zero the velocity of uh, this thing. So there you go. Action, zero velocity. Uh, did something, did something cool happen here? Alright, so we can go there. Uh, I don't know if that really zeroed the velocity. We can pause. We can go over here. Actions. Zero velocity. Boom! Oh my god! Whoa! Oh, that is fucking awesome. I gotta admit, I didn't expect that to happen. Wow, is that a new thing? Wow! That was super fucking cool! <laughs> Whoa! Wow! Hey, I, I like that. It I want to see that again. Okay, alright. So let's go, let's let's do this. Alright, so we got our we got our, this stuff here. And let's change this down. You know, we want to go uh yeah, seconds. Alright. So we were just seeing that. And we got the these things. Uh, maybe, you know, maybe a little bit more seconds to seconds. So something like that. So we got this. When we can pause. We can, you know, we'll go a little faster. So we'll make it, you know, one minute per second. Oh, wow. This is a crazy fast. Oh, well, it's one minute per second. But still, that seems still pretty crazy fast. Okay. So we got this guy over here. And that's that. And actions. Zero the velocity. All right, so now we can just comfortably go here and maybe check this out. All right, so it's pulling it in. It means we can start lowering this number. Okay. Oh, man, I wish there was like a... No, not milliseconds per second. That's a bit extreme. Seconds per second. Okay, we can see the movement. Three seconds per second. All right, let's go to nine seconds per second. All right, so it's about to it's about to hit the pulsar, guys. It's gonna happen. Let's get a close up look. Although it might, oh, boom! So it ignites. All right, I'm gonna stop moving so you guys can, because I was zooming out, so you guys can see the expansion. Oh wow! And then this thing, just getting a really cool view of this. Oh no. All right, I want to double click on this one. We can get a view of that. So, oh, that is dope as shit. And let's just start speeding it up. Oh, man. That's wild. Wow. All right. Go faster. Oh, and it just kind of washes all over it. Oh, it's not washed over it yet. Come on. Let's see this go. Oh, yeah, there you go. It's passing right through it. Wow, that is really, really awesome. Okay, that was that was way cooler than I would have thought. Um, now, there was something else that I saw. I thought maybe it would be an open... Uh, but it was something like some Game of Thrones type simulation that they had. Huh. Uh, create game. No, it doesn't seem to be there. Ah, oh, man, I, I read about it in their thing, but I, I don't know. I don't really know what it is. This... All right, let's try open. Hmm, My Sims Planet, what was the, I, I swear, it must be in something in here, but it's something about Game of Thrones, Moon 75 Orbits. Is this stable now? That used to not be stable at all. No, it, okay. It's not, I don't think it's intended to be like a stable orbit. Uh, solar System, no moons, okay. Exoplanets. There was something that was... Oh, here it is. All right. So for all you... For all you Game of Thrones fans... 
I, I don't know what what this... Okay, so here's Westeros. I, I don't watch Game of Thrones myself because I do not have an HBO subscription. Yep, I know. It's lame. Does this have two sons? Is that the idea? Oh, that's really cool. So this is like a stable binary star system where there are like two sons. Is that what's going on in Game of Thrones? Because if so, that is really, really cool. So here's Westeros. Uh, here's what we know about it. It's probably going to be surface temperature. Uh, you know, it, it fluctuates. Yeah, of course. But climate, uh, you know. Uh, seems, you know. Yeah. There you go. Okay. That is really cool. Wow. The carbon, yeah, greenhouse gas is 2010 level. Seems to be similar to Earth in that one. Um, we could zero... We could zero the velocity, but I don't think that's really going to do it. Uh, we could powers, uh, try maybe forcing it, but again, I don't really know what that does. I mean, we've tried it before, and okay, let's get out of, let's get out of the powers menu. We want to double click on that one so we can zoom in, and here it is. Okay, so here's our planet, and we can slow a little bit down, you know, don't make it that fast. Okay, great. Um, excuse me, where the hell are we? Where are these stars? Oh, there they are. Okay, cool. So I wanted to go over here so we can look at the stars. Great. So uh, powers, force, boom, boom. I don't know. Uh, Jupiter, one. There you go. Boom. Let's do anything. Min range. I, I don't know. Max range. Inner angle. Honestly, I have no idea if that does anything. So, uh, that, that just, that just seems, who knows, material? Dispense material, okay. Oh, so we can, like, dispense material at it? Oh, that's cool. Uh, let's dispense, uh, water at it. Velocity. I don't know, sure, sure, let's just shoot water at the, at that. Actually, here's something that'd be fun. Why don't we shoot water at, like, a star? I don't think it's going to happen, but hey, you know, this obviously is not going to work. I know for a bunch of reasons. Uh, dispensing water at a star isn't going to... Sun 1 and Sun 2, so they don't have names? I would have thought they would had they would have had names. But hey, you know what? I'm not... I haven't watched Game of Thrones, so there you go. So, uh, I know that uh, dispensing water into a star is not going to uh, make it not ignite anymore. I'm aware of this, but, you know, you can sort of think about it that way. So if I, like, shoot the water over here, it just goes, woo, all the way in there. Well, that's pretty neat. What does launch do? Launch Mercury. Oh, Jesus. Um, excuse me, how big is Mercury? Uh, Venus? Uh, I, I, I'm kind of scared of just putting this in. Maybe this is like, I think. Yeah, I think they, I think they got the scale of this system a bit off. Okay. <laughs> uh, I don't know. Should I, should I just put down Mercury and just see what happens? Is it gonna break the game again? All right, sure. Let's try it out. Power launch. I don't know. Sure. Um, planets. Mercury. Oh. Is Mercury just permanently... Okay, you know what? I'm just going to exit that. I don't know what's going on with this. But there you go. Very, very cool indeed. Sweet. Oh, so now that last thing we're going to do in the video, and that is, of course... Uh, okay, so that was in fiction. Uh, okay, Nomad. Upcoming book by Matthew Mather. And Lands of Ice and Fire, Game of Thrones. So you can see that. That's very cool. Uh, so, okay, we wanted to check out the Pulsar thing and see if we crash the game again. Uh, or not. So, sorry, all, pulsar, binary pulsar. Okay, so we got that. And now we... Okay, so we're running in milliseconds per second. So clearly, let's, let's slow it down a little bit to less milliseconds per second. And if we just take up the mass, does that break the game? I have no idea. Let's keep trying. All right. Does that... What has that done? I'll be honest with you. I don't know. 
Are they orbiting themselves? I don't know either. Well, if they are, can I... I'll zero... Here you go. So we'll pause. Actions. I'll zero the velocity of this one. And then we'll see what happens. Uh, it's going to be something uh, catastrophic. There you go. So this one should start... falling into the other one unless it doesn't have a trail so let's see what happens when two pulsars collide so it should happen unless they unless they're not view uh orbits yeah trails should i view trails i don't know let's see pause trails so we want to see the trails i guess because if we see a trail, then we know where they're going. Are they going towards each other? These things are hard to tell. There doesn't really seem to be a trail. Other than, do they, are they just rotating in and on themselves? Yes, orbits. Trails, orbits. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. This thing right over here. If we could like, if we could somehow like collide them, that would be very cool. But I don't think they're gonna they're gonna do that. All right, so I can I click on this one. Actions. Zero velocity. That one. Oh geez, yeah, it showed a flash of light. Oh. Oh yeah, oh yeah, it's done it. Okay, so after a certain point, your, your game. Oh, okay. Well, it's not it's not crashed. It just I don't know what's going on. So you can click X. And all right, so maybe it isn't crashed. Maybe something else has happened. Explode. I don't know. Maybe not explode. Edit. So it hasn't crashed, but something has happened. Or the game is not happy at all. So I what can I, I I can still do this stuff. Okay. And then Well time has ticked by, but I can't click on this menu anymore. Interesting. View. The menu's kinda go over hmm edit add we can't really add stuff what's going on maybe maybe if I just go and I like double click on one of them go to actions open bodies folder that's not what I wanted to do all right we can make it full screen but this the menu doesn't seem to work anymore for whatever reason. I don't think it is crashed. I think I'm just not understanding something about the game that I should. Because clearly, the game still works. So what's going on here? I don't know. It sort of and it flashes the UI. That's the weird part. Every click flashes the UI. Well, clearly, I'm going to end the episode here. So I'm going to say that I hope you guys have enjoyed this one. And as always, I'll see you guys next time. Aw oh, yeah. Cue the royalty free music. Three, two, one, go. Come on everybody, get on your feet. Stand up, look at the screen and repeat. I'm going to like, rate, comment, and subscribe. I love watching Aether vids all of the time. Thanks for dropping by and spending the time. Hope you've enjoyed, and let's get on with our lives. Oh yeah. Thanks to Kevin McLeod for these awesome beats. Oh yeah. Have a good one.